Spanish, it is Rise of Space. His little space, whatever you know me as. And I am super duper excited for today's video for you guys. I thought it would be super fun to show you guys how I made my own sticker log. And I'm going to make a sticker log to show you guys exactly how I did it. The coolest part about this all is that the sticker log that I am making, I will be giving away to one of my followers on my spam regression Instagram, Crants and Pencils. So go follow me over there if you would like to enter and follow the enter rules on the post that I post over there. Then you can have a chance to win the sticker log that I made for you to use. My face won't be in the majority of this video. It'll mostly be my hands because I will be working with things and showing you how I do them. But I will be back at the end. So let's get started. So the things that you will need for this project are a notebook, some pens, some stickers, some scissors, and some tape. The first thing that you are going to want to do is decorate the cover however you want. I personally usually like to decorate the cover with stickers. I like to spell some things out. Now once the front is all decorated the way you want it, you are going to go into the notebook and rip out the first page. After you do that, flip to the back of the notebook, to the back page. And you are going to want to cut these little pieces off of the edge of the paper if that's the kind of notebook you have. And then what we're going to do is we're going to cut a line like this to make a pocket for the back of the book. Now once you have that pocket there, you are going to want to take the tape that we had earlier and just tape over it so it stays in the notebook. And now you have a little pocket here that you can put things in. My next step for you is to take some of these stickers that you bought and to cut them up into smaller pieces so you can fit them back into the back of the pocket of the notebook. Once you have your stickers all cut up, they should be able to just slide right into the pouch so you can keep all of your stickers for your sticker log right there with you. And that's basically it. That's how you make your own DIY sticker log. I will show you mine in just a minute to give you kind of inspiration for what to do in yours. This is my sticker log that I have and have been using for a while and I absolutely love the way the system works. So me and my daddy formulated this log together and this is how we keep track of rewards and stuff for me being good and doing the things that I need to do. On the first page are my sticker rewards. These are my money rewards so these are the ones that I can cash in for money or if I want to buy something. And then the next page is my non-money rewards. So if we don't have enough money to cash in a money reward I can cash in one of these rewards. And after that it just starts with my sticker chart. So I write down the date, the things that I earn stickers for, the total amount of stickers overall, and the amount of stickers that I got today. And then of course the fun part comes with putting the stickers on the notebook. And you can use whatever stickers you like. I use random stickers here and there. Recently I have been using the ribbons because they're small enough and they're cheap. They're only from the dollar store. But sometimes I still like to go back and do fun stickers. Yay, we did it! Thank you so much for making a sticker log with me. 
If you enjoyed this video and want to see more content from me, you should definitely subscribe to my channel here and my two other channels which are linked down below. You can follow me on all of my social media which is linked in the description as well and support me through Patreon and Ko-Fi if you wish. Again, thank you so much for watching and being here with me. I love you guys so, 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 so much and I will see you soon. Goodbye!